so this video is something I've been putting off. Um, I've had these in the background. I don't know if you can see. These bins, these pink bins, have just been sitting for maybe two weeks. <laughs> um, so I have my, what I plan on organizing, which is my um, vintage, um, I don't think any of it is antique, but vintage glass collection. Most of it is 50s. Um, iced tea glasses and some of them are there's one set that's from the 70s and then I have pink depression era bowl and plate like it's it's a lot of mixture it's a good mixture of glass vintage glass stuff and it's it's one of the things that I just can't stop buying whenever I see a vintage set of any any kitchenware I must have it so yeah so we're gonna organize that and then put and put it underneath the bed because <laughs> my closet is so full it's just every time I open it I'm scared something's gonna fall down and yeah it's not I know and my bed is a mess because I took <laughs> I took out I took out the box with all of the glassware in it and on top of the box I had a bunch of my crap so I have like my old yearbook sitting up here then I have some random clothes and then I have some like old pictures like it's a bunch of random stuff but I'm gonna start now and Max already sat on the box with all the glass in it thanks Max Hello, I am on the floor. Well, I was the whole time. <laughs> but here is the box. It's not that big, but it actually has quite a lot of stuff in it. And oh, the camera is moving. So this says, oh, I forgot about this. I have so much, <laughs> so much of this stuff. This has been taped a million times. Like I've opened and closed this thing a million times. Like it's, look at that. This need, this really was well overdue. All of this stuff is bubble wrapped. So I'll probably open up a few of them to just show the camera um, because yeah, like I took the time to bubble wrap everything. But I do want to see some of these things again because it's been well over a year since this has been put away. And it's also pretty, and I would like to look at it. Oh ho ho! Oh my god. <gasps> These are the 90s. Okay, we'll open up this one just to look at the horror. Oh, I forgot about. Damn, I forgot about so much of the stuff in here. Ooh, just come out of your sleeve, please. Oh, I love. This one, I got. Pretty much all of these I got from thrift stores. So this one I got from a thrift store. Just got some sticky stuff on it. But this one's really pretty. It has this pink and then it has like a... I'm so bad with colors. I'm so, well, more specifically bad with like blue-greeny colors. So this must be a blue-green color because I can't tell what color it is. <laughs> Um, is it a mint? <laughs> I cannot tell. Is, can, can someone tell me if that is a mint color? This one was like the second set. I think there's four of these and I love them. They're, they're on the thinner side. So, and I think that's because they are newer. Um, any, any of my 50s and then my 70s um, glass is thicker which I like. <laughs> That's why I'm more wary to use these because they are thinner and they're so dainty and pretty. So I'm like, it's so pretty and I'm so clumsy. I don't want these to break. <laughs> so I'm gonna just slowly start putting like the same ones together and then we'll see how much we can fit in one bin because I have two of these. So 
this wall, this should all fit between the two and I should probably have more room. Um, I have other boxes full of things, glass things that are kind of scattered around because they're, the shapes are harder to put together. Um, yeah, it's a puzzle piece together. So we'll see how this goes. Oh, that's perfect. I don't know if you can see, but they perfectly, one, two, perfect width. Oh my God, this is great. And then this one, so precious. This used to be my sister's and then she's gonna, oh, that's too bright. There we go. Um, this is my sister's and she was going to re-donate it. But I was like, um, I would like that. But it has a little bee. Look at the bee. Can you see the bee? It's so precious. I really... Oh, and it has the name Ash something. And my name's Ashley. So, um, yeah, this was meant to be. But the, ugh, I just... I can't say no to cups. I love, I love holding cups. Just... Doesn't that, doesn't hold, like, wouldn't holding this bring you joy? Like, look at the bee, it would, it, it greets you every sip. Oh, I forgot about these, but wait, are these, what plates are these? I don't know anything I have. Oh, this is from a set, a tea set. I forgot I had a tea set. How does one forget? that they have a tea set. <laughs> Maybe because I don't drink tea, so I don't feel the necessity to have these things out. Also, I don't have the space to have a full collection out. But, um, huh, funny story, I when I initially got these and I was packing them, um, I had them in a box on the bed, and I was dumb, and just, I left the room for two seconds and then I came back or like as I was coming back I hear this crash and Max this little bitch he's looking at me as I'm speaking right now um he decided he should climb in the box and I should have seen it coming because cats and box go cats and boxes go hand in hand so yeah um a few of the plates broke and <laughs> I'm dramatic so I was on the floor sobbing because I just bought them and it was like a dream set and I got a full full set for like $20 or it might have even been cheaper than that I can't even remember it's been a while but yeah but my sister and mom were so sweet they're like it's okay you can get other plates to kind of put together with this and mix and match because you you like eclectic stuff right and they were so sweet and I was like I'm sorry for crying but you know it's this is I'm a Pisces I just any situation my first reaction is to cry <laughs> so I always I'll open up one and then maybe because there's the creamer and then there's some other things I, oh yeah there's probably the teacups in here as well so I'll like do one of each because these are really precious from my memory because <laughs> it's been a while. Oh, these are so pretty. I forgot how pretty these are. Look at how dainty. Oh, no, you can't, you can't see. <laughs> you can, now you can. Look at that. It's the perfect shade of pink in my opinion. And then it has flowers on it. And it's just, it's so beautiful. And these are Rooksville, China. I, you know what? I never looked the brand up to see when these were made. I should have, because I actually don't know when, when these were made. I, re I can't tell. I really can't tell. I couldn't tell you. I'm not that good with like looking at things and being able to tell what era it's from. Like, I'm probably better than like 
someone that doesn't know anything about vintage things, but like for someone who loves vintage stuff, I'm probably not that good <laughs> at, at pinpointing eras. But I do know when something's pretty and that is pretty. So I, I'm, yeah, I'm glad I'm looking at these again. So that's the one plate. We will look for like plates so they can live together. Oh. I just don't remember having these. Oh my goodness, these are heavy. Can you see? No, you can never see because I have, I have it locked. These, these look like, um, almost like little chess pieces to me. They're really heavy. And very old. But they're beautiful. I pro oh, that's squeaky. Probably would never use them. It says a lot of friends. Something? I don't know. You can't. I'm terrible at this. Excuse me. Can you see? No, you can't. You can see me though. But yeah, these there's set of tool. They're so heavy. You could these these are weapons. Pretty pretty weapons. You could stab someone with that. I'm not saying you should, but you could. <gasps> these are the teapots. Or not the teapots, I can't speak. These are the teacups. There is a tea, is there a teapot in here? I don't, I don't remember. My memory is fantastic. So we will show one teapot. I, I, said, I said it again, teacup. Tea Max, you're being really good. This is night and day difference between, um, from when he destroyed plates to this collection. He is kind of glaring at me though, so. Oh, these are so pretty. Oh, I forgot this also has like an inside thing. We will, can you see her? Look at, I love how it's pointed. It's point, it's a little pointy ear. Look how, and, and then the, that, it's just, and then look at the inside, look at it. It's just, it's a little flower greeting you. Every sip, every sip you take, you see a pretty flower. I'm sorry. Anyway, so that's the teacup. Cause I know how words work, but I just, I think the Handles are it's really special. I haven't I haven't seen many with this shape and Then this detailing on the bottom as well Like I feel like I see like stuff on the top, but I don't often see it on the bottom here Or maybe I haven't seen that many and I just don't know anything about teacups that could be Possible, <laughs> but these are really precious and I love I, spent, I just, anything when it has the little like peekaboo thing on the inside, I just, I melt and cry and it's just so pretty. So here's the one bin. Almost, almost all of it fit. I have a, I have a bowl. No, that, those aren't bowls. I have a plate. Or no, this is actually a platter, I think. So this is a platter from the set of, um, from the tea set and then this thing this is a creamer is this like does does the sugar go in this one uh i don't know anything about tea because i don't drink tea so i i don't know why i have a tea set if i don't drink tea but it's pretty so i needed it anyway these are the 70s cups. The only reason why I know they're from the 70s is because I was on Instagram and on the explore page I saw a listing, at least someone was selling the full set. I didn't even know a full set existed. So I got the set like 
a mall, but a mall that had like, caught like mm, it had like country stuff, and then like a very small section had like actual vintage kitchenware, like cups and stuff, like mostly like glass cups and like pictures and you know stuff like that. And yeah, I got I have had these for many years. Um, it. it maybe even since 2011 so these I've had these for a long time but they are really pretty pretty they're the shape I don't know if you can see how pretty the shape is and they're big these are big boys and the color like it's it's the ripple like the ripple effect here it looks like water and I remember just filling this up to the top with ice and then just having ice water in this and it was just the most refreshing thing and yeah I love these cups I knowing now knowing that it is part of the set and there's a pitcher like a big beautiful blue pitcher that matches this I would probably like to own it but um do I need it no do I have the space for it also no but yeah these are I kind of wish I could have these out but they're pretty big and I don't have enough space so yeah you know, you know it's there I still have them I won't get rid of this it's too beautiful these ones are too big they can't like like the 90s ones they can't just go bloop bloop like these are big boys so i will have to puzzle piece this together maybe like this maybe they'll live like that instead and then i'll do that that works, I guess. So, this is, yeah, you can totally see that. That's just a white blob to you. <laughs> so this is the sugar one. Um, I should probably open up one of these for you guys to see. Where are my scissors? There they are. Oh, I should probably not slam it. I, I went ham on this. Can, you can't see anything. Okay. Oh no, it's like stuck to it. I don't like that. Oh, that's beautiful. See, once again, pointy little ears. So beautiful. She's so plump. And she's got just little just covered in flowers I I love I I can't believe I forgot I had these but that's what happens when you have so much stuff that you have to put it in storage you know so um <laughs> the uh well, you can kind of see it but it, it's really cool because it has the elf ears on both sides so this one's really cool. I think the only thing that's missing from this is like the teapot and then like the little, this probably should have a little hat, but she does not have a hat, but it's still cute. So, and this is the platter. I guess this one's easy to pull out. So I will show this one. It just, it's like in a little sleeve and then it's in a little bag. It is so pretty. I love. It's it's so pretty. Just imagine little treats sitting upon this plate. I don't know what kind of treats. Honestly, even something dumb. Like imagine just chicken nuggets just sitting on here. The classiest chicken nuggets. Or I could actually put something classy on it, but um the likelihood of that is um, not that high. <laughs> Probably put something dumb on this. Or even cupcakes, you know, the, their options are limitless. 
Yeah, this one's in great condition. This is one of the survivors. I think I was left with two plates and a platter. I think two, I think two plates broke. So I'm glad I was left with two and not just one. Thank goodness. Oh my, oh my God, I forgot. One of the things that my mom said, it was so sweet when I was sobbing and everything was broken, a AKA two things were broken. Um, since I was left with two, she was like, oh my gosh, it's okay, just think about it. You were left with two, so you and your future girlfriend or wife could have a tea party for two. And I was like, my heart hurt because that was just so sweet that that was what she said to comfort me because I was crying over broken, <laughs> broken tea set. <sighs> I feel like that, that whole thing just sums up who I am as a person. <laughs> And then who my family are. I think that's, um, I'll put this away, but I think that's it. And there's still space for, for more, no, not, not for more, because I should not buy any more, but. <laughs> so this is one of the um, 50s iced tea glasses that I have out and actually in my kitchen. Um, this one actually comes with six, so. This is the largest set that I have. This, this is not vintage. These are from Walmart, from the Pioneer Woman, I believe. Um, these are definitely vintage inspired. Um, and she has a couple other things that are obviously vintage inspired. So if you like these, maybe look into actual vintage stuff. So that's it. Um, not that interesting probably to many people but this is pretty self-indulgent and a reason to do it because i did not want to organize stuff today but because i told myself you're doing a video to give it more of a push anyway so i hope you found this somewhat enjoyable um and Max didn't break anything. That is a huge plus to this video. <laughs> um, so yeah, bye. That was where he was the whole time, judging me. And that's all the crap on my bed I still have to put away. <laughs> he wants to play with the box. I mean, you can, it's empty. There's nothing in it. You can play in the box. He's thinking about it. Max, I give you full permission. Do you want to go in the box? It's allowed this time, it's empty. The one time he's holding himself back. Maxine. He's acquired the box. How you doing, Max? And he sits. Very nice. If you stayed this long, this is a bonus. Um, take a gander at this atrocity. So, um, yeah, this is my graduation yearbook. And we look at the demons. <laughs> Pretty cool, right? Super neat. So yeah, this is my graduation picture. The most emo thing to have ever happened. No wonder that was a, like, that screams lesbian. <laughs>